Welcome folks to uh, MJ Tabletop Creations and Games. I'm Martin. Julie. And Julie. <laughs> <laughs> so this is an MJ uh, unboxing. We will have our bi-weekly chat uh, for Sunday, also this week. Um, and then of course we're going to do the last kind of remarks before we go into Oathmark week. So today I have an unboxing for you guys. We, Julie and I, she, she's been helping me a lot in the studio guys. And um, she's gonna help me kind of base coat these. These are the uh, two new uh, kits that I got for Oathmark. And the humans. The humans, <laughs> the humans and the dwarves. So let's go check out the models now. And Julie's gonna help me with the unboxing. All right, so Julie's opening up the human infantry. And let's see if we can get all, look at all that plastic. Look at that. Yes. Wait, oh, wait a minute. Uh-oh. Yes, very oh, cool, okay. very cool. So we got some bases here, okay. right? And um, we got bases and, okay. Well, this is the sprue that I, I put some stuff together already. Okay, because I want to show okay. You guys, yeah, those over there. Yeah, yeah. so, okay. so this is the sprue. Um, look at these, Julie. Um, so you can see the bodies here, and there are how many sprues there? Six, I believe. There's six. You get yeah. six sprues. Yes. Yes. Okay. Mm -hmm. So it, this is basically all your variant models are in this one sprue, and then you get six duplicates of these. Okay, so you get five different bodies, and look at those. Look at the detail on some of those, and they're upside down. I know. I'm like, uh, <laughs> I was like, wait a minute. <laughs> wait a minute. Right. What are you going on, Martin? <laughs> <laughs> but there you go. Now you have them right there side you up. Go. There you go. And you got a variety of different armor, and you got a, a couple of different poses here. Um, okay, and that gives you a sense of the variety. Now, when you put these together, you only have five bodies, but there are t a ton of different heads. If I can find the heads, which are down here, okay? Yeah. Look at all those little heads. You got yeah, a variety I see, I see of, yeah. of different details and things that you can add to the bodies. And then you also have a nice selection of weapon arms. Mm -hmm. So you have bows, um, you have spears, um, swords, you know, swords yeah. a good choice of, of weapon types. And then uh, this is what was interesting. If you look at the shields, the shields remind me very much of like Roman shields. Mm -hmm. And in the back there, there's a hole on, on the shield. And I couldn't figure out like, oh, why is that hole there? And I realized then that you can actually put the shield right on the hand mm -hmm. of the... Uh, shield arm and then it'll look like the guy's actually putting that shield in front of him right, you know right. instead of off to the side like exactly. usual so that's I a, like that idea it's yeah, nice to have a choice yeah yeah it is and it, it's a nice little touch mm -hmm. so I'm just going to focus this a little bit to give you guys a good view on the details see so look at all that uh, detail now um so there are the bodies. Uh, here you have an axe weapon, okay? So that pretty much takes care of the humans. And you get 30 infantry models. So you get quite a bit of, of models here. Mm -hmm. Now, the, other, the last thing I wanna say is uh, molds, the mold lines. Um, one of the nice things is that, is that the mold lines are like in the crotch there. So you don't really see them, mm -hmm. okay? And even like as I'm looking through some of the weapons, uh, weapon arms, you know, you don't really see the mold lines. So that's a nice touch. Mm -hmm. Now you are going to be doing some cleaning because you've got to, you know, take these things out and you're going to have little lumps of plastic. Right. So you will have to take out your files and you will have to do a little bit of cleaning on these guys. But otherwise, not bad. No, no flash, you know, nothing like that. So, and then these are the bases. They're mm -hmm. 25 millimeter squares. So, nice bases. Nice All right, let's move on to the okay. dwarves. Okay. And I'm going to show you guys the assembled models in just a bit. And Julie's opening up the dwarves. 
I think you go. have dwarves in your kingdom, don't you? I do. Yeah. yeah. I have humans too. And you have humans, yeah. All right. So again, this is a very similar layout. Mm -hmm. uh, it's pretty much consistent throughout the Oathmark range. All right. So there's your bases, and how how do you like those uh, those sprues? Right. Yeah, they're good. Isn't that great? Now yeah. look look at the, the details. Amazing. Yeah, the, the the detail. If you could yeah. just hold it there, sure. I'll zoom in so people can see the different armor details. Mm -hmm. I mean, not bad, really, guys. No, it's really those. Um, the shields are really nice. And the shields. Look at the shield details. Mm -hmm. Yeah, very uh, Viking like. You know. Yes. Right. Um, and then here are the heads, and look at all the variety of heads that you guys get. Mm -hmm. Now. Again, you're going to, when you cut these, you're going to have little lumps mm -hmm. of plastic. You're going to have to really file those down very mm -hmm. carefully. That's the only, I guess, con. Mm -hmm. Pros and cons Pros to and everything. Cons, yep. But not bad. Now, if we could just show some of the weapons. Look at what you... right here, right down here. Okay. Sorry, guys, if the camera's moving a lot. Um, Look at those axes. Look at the ornate right, yeah. detail on those axes. I love that. Yeah, really nice. Aren't they? Mm -hmm. So, Julie, you'll probably be using these guys mostly. There's a nice war hammer. Mm -hmm. That war hammer. And uh, I, really, I really like. And then you get some details here. You, like, it looks like a pipe or something. A little horn or yeah. something. You get some details, and you, you can put these on the body, so not bad. Very nice. Now, let me show you guys. So you, again, you get 30 figures, mm -hmm. six sprues. All your variation is on one sprue, okay? And then the rest are just duplicates. But you have enough that your guys are going to look different. Now, let's look at these guys. These are the assembled guys. Check that out. Nice. That guy's holding a, a, a mace. I yeah, love that. The like flanged it. mace. Yeah. You know, so I did one of those guys. I did a guy with like the uh, war hammer. Mm -hmm. Oh, and that's a cool shield. Yeah, look yeah. at that shield. Yep. Very Viking-ish. I, I like that. Um, Definitely. Yeah, and look at that ornate axe. Yeah. So they're going to, you guys do uh, dry brushing or uh, ink washes. You know, they're going to look really nice, guys. So, and this is my banner, man. It's great detail on all of them. It's, it's really nice detail. Yeah, so yeah. Uh, trying to get the camera focused there. But there's the axe man, another mm -hmm. axe man. So I got quite a few like of them. So I built five, and then these are the humans. And look at that Roman-style shield. Yeah. I love that. Pesky humans. Yeah, those pesky humans. <laughs> now, it, he, this is what I meant about the shield mm -hmm. and the hole, mm -hmm. is that you could position it in such a way that he's actually blocking. Yeah. All right. And then I'm giving, I'm doing five bows. So you'll have sort of an archery. I like that. Yeah. I like archers. Yeah, I know you liked range, so I try mm -hmm. to give you some, some ranged mm -hmm. capability. Yeah, I do like range. And then uh, here's a spearman. Look at that. Uh, mm -hmm. The mustaches and the, you know. Yeah, very cool. Very cool. So, and there's another guy with the, the heavy mustache. And I think that's his hair. Yeah, I think you're right. Yeah. So, very, very nice job, North Star. Uh, this is from North Star Military Miniatures. These are the humans and dwarves. For Oathmark. All right. So how do you feel about those dwarves and humans? I think they're great. I can't wait to start painting base them. painting them. Yeah, mm -hmm. yeah. And Julie's doing a lot of the base coating now for me. And she's learning some of the new techniques. Like uh, mm -hmm. uh, some of the stuff that we all do in the hobby. Like uh, washing and all that. Dry brushing. Dry brushing. Mm -hmm. You know, so Julie's really kicking it in the studio. She's really <laughs> helping me out. And it's I'm having great. a lot of fun. And you're having fun. Yeah. And that's the important thing, right, that guys? Is, that's, it, it's, that's what it's all about. It's all about having mm -hmm. fun. And that's what my channel is about. It's just about having fun it with is. the hobby. Yeah. So uh, that was our little unboxing for dwarves, guys. Uh, we're just learning all this stuff. And uh, I hope that it is of interest to you guys. So... Thank you and welcome new subscribers. Thank you for yes. coming on board. 
guests, yes. Welcome. Yeah. Welcome, everyone. So you will hear more from us. I will have another uh, Wednesday chat for you guys. It's an MJ early special. <laughs> and we're going to talk about <laughs> Ghost Archipelago in that chat. So Awesome. All right. Thank you, guys. Take care. Bye now.